<sighs> All right, people. It's me, Daniel P. again. And I've made that hard decision. Just for you. As this cat tries to come out of the door and scratch while I'm recording. All right, like I was saying, I made that decision. Which album is better between Kiss Land and Beauty Behind the Madness? Let me grab the envelope. Pretend I'm opening it. The album that is better, in my opinion, has to be Kissland. Right, just because I'm saying that Kissland is better doesn't make Beauty Behind the Bandits bad. I'm saying that when I listen to both of those albums, things to both of them appeal to me. They're very different albums and they're very different sounds. I feel like um, in Beauty Behind the Madness, The Weeknd was just experimenting and going for different sounds and they still sound really good with what he did and I really like that album. But what he did with Kissland, I feel like he put us in in a mood the entire album and you would just feel like you are in that mood like throughout. It's more cohesive, I would say. With Beauty Behind the Madness, I just feel like it was a bunch of samples of, hey, I could do this sound, I could do this sound, I could do whatever sound you want and it'll feel and it'll sound good and you'll like it, which is what he did. Like I'm saying, I'm not shitting on Beauty Behind the Madness because it was good. It was, he gave us some of the old weekend, not the old, old weekend, but what we're used to hearing from the weekend. And then he brought some new weekend and, and it still sounded good. It's, it's a really good album. I love that album. But Kissland, again, it was, it was just kept you in the same mood. Like it was very grand. I feel like it was very grand scheme. Like you could feel grand listening to it if that makes sense like I was saying I just wanted to put that out there I really love both albums but Kiss Line just goes over it just that little bit just because of the cohesiveness and just the feel of the entire album just keeping you in that mood and I really like albums that can do that to you and I really can't wait for another weekend thing weekend album even though he just came out with one I still cannot wait I Weekend's my, one of my favorite artists, and yeah, that's it. Bye, Felicia. Tell everyone to have a blessed day. Tell them.